What the fuck up, world? What the fuck up, world? Real quick, real fast. I want to talk about the boots and uh, getting kicked off the uh, the tour, the down south uh, Street Kings tour. It's a big old, you know what I'm saying? Big old tour. If you don't know about it, it's a big tour going on as far as the street legends, you know what I'm saying? You got Juvenile, fucking Gucci Man, Jeezy, Rick Ross, all these, you know what I'm saying? Legends, you know what I'm saying? But my whole thing is it wouldn't be a down south one without Boosie. Like, it really doesn't make any motherfucking sense. You know what I'm saying? And the shit, like, bro, one thing I can say, and um, one thing I can say about people in Baltimore, nigga, they love Boosie. So I really feel like that was some funny-ass style shit, you know what I'm saying, by the uh, fake Gucci, you know what I'm saying? I, I don't feel like that's the real Gucci. But the real Gucci, he wouldn't have had no problem with that shit. He'd be like, man, come on. Fuck it, we're gonna go keep on getting money. I mean, that's how I feel as a fan, just looking at the shit. I could be wrong, like I say, people change. But at the same style, it's still some funny style ass shit. Like, we don't even know what the fuck happened. But then you ain't tell people that a nigga was kicked off. Now, that's a problem because a lot of people in Baltimore, they love motherfucking boosters. You know what I'm saying? So you really stealing people motherfucking money. And, um,. I, I don't know. I, that's just that's just crazy as fuck to me. You know what I mean, I felt like um I don't even really feel like it was more so Gucci. I feel like it was the people who were behind Gucci who was uh you know what I'm saying paying for the concert. You know what I'm saying shareholders and all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying. But uh, shout out to Booster, a real one, still getting his money, man. That dude is an example of how you really you know what I'm saying. You grind and get what you want. You know what I'm saying? Just, you know what I'm saying? I'm not raising them up or nothing. But at the same time, I'm giving a man his props. You know what I'm saying? For doing what he do. You know what I'm saying? Shit, he done started a trend. He got people buying acres of land now. You know what I'm saying? That's cool. I wish I could buy some acres of land. But now, nah, I just really don't feel like it would really be a, a fire-ass concert without Boosie. And the way y'all did the nigga, that was pretty fucked up. You know what I'm saying? But like I say, nigga been getting back in money for years doing them little concerts and shows and cause listen, the man got a cult following, that shit undeniable. <clears throat> I can say that much. But um, yeah, that's just my whole thing. Do you think it the tour is still I mean, cause I feel like they lost a lot of money, especially going to Baltimore without Boosie and then not telling people that Boosie was there. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, and Boosie just as relevant as all them was, you know what I'm saying? I mean, all them is today. So they really needed that motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? And um, shit, another thing, shit, he was rapping, he he bust out on the scene before them. Uh, before Gucci, before uh, Jeezy, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Juvenile, you know what I'm saying? One of the people who started that shit. And is T.I. on the, um, is T.I. on the tour? Oh no, I'm tripping. Gucci Man and T.I. don't like each other. Duh, I'm stupid. Damn, that see that all that shit. See, see what beef do. See what dumbass beef do. It keep you from enjoying the best shit in life. That would have been a bomb ass tour. I don't know, man. I don't know. I, I just got an opinion though, and um, I just felt like that was some dirty ass shit. You know what I'm saying? To kick the nigga off the tour. And not tell everybody. You know what I'm saying? I'm speaking from a fan's perspective. I'm not even taking up for Boosie. You know what I'm saying? Or it, you never know what it could have been. It could have been contract obligations or, you know what I'm saying, anything. You know what I'm saying? Insurance policy. You never know. You know what I'm saying? But um, long story short, speaking from a fan perspective, yeah, that's funny style than the motherfucker. And the concert supposed to be coming here in Duval in November. Ah. You know what I mean? Like, damn. You know what I mean? Kind of conflicted. <laughs> but nah, I do want to go to the concert, but it be, it's like, damn, boots ain't no, It's kind of sour. You know what I'm saying? It dampens the night. Uh, uh, put, it's, like, it's like taking a piece from a, a, a picture. You know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck? You don't, you don't do that. But um, would have made a lot of money, man. Mm-hmm. Hmm. 
business, business, business. I don't know, man. I don't know. But like I said, I just got an opinion. And um, as a Bootsy fan, I feel like I, I, you know what I'm saying, speak as a fan. Like, that's some funny style ass shit. But anyway, I just got an opinion. I ain't trying to say the word. Oh, well.